If your game looks like that and you want more FPS in game, you are the right place. In this video I'm going to show the best window settings and the best in-game settings. So make sure to stay until the end of the video and now enjoy. Boosting your FPS environment can help you improve your gaming experience by making the game more smoother and more responsive. So the first thing we are going to do is the easiest one, we are going to lower the in-game settings. So lower the graphical settings such as texture quality, shadow quality and effects. This is the easiest way to boost your FPS in-game. The next step is also pretty easy, we need to make sure that the graphics card drivers are up to date, so I'm using Nvidia video card, so I'm going to type GeForce experience in the search bar and see if everything is up to date. As you can see, everything is updated. Also check if your operating system is up to date, as newer updates might contain performance improvements. Another way to boost your FPS is game mode. Game mode is a feature that can potentially improve performance while gaming. You can enable it by going to settings, gaming, gaming mode and turning it on. The feature is stopping background taps and also prevents frame rate drops. So it's pretty good setting to have on and also make sure Xbox game mode is off because sometimes it might send you some notification and it's not that good for your PC. Now we are going to talk about background process. We need to close any unnecessary background applications, especially those consuming significant resources like web browsers and video streaming apps. Then we can go to the task manager and disable any starting apps, so your PC is not lagging and it's not lowering your performance. Another easy way to boost your FPS is turning on hardware accelerated GPU. This helps with reducing the latency and also improving performance. Then go down to graphics performance preference and choose Valorant Win64Shipping.exe and then choose high performance. This helps a lot with the latency and the FPS because now Valorant is on high performance. Then we can go to NVIDIA control panel, then to 3D settings and make sure power management mode is set to prefer maximum performance. And that's pretty much everything, I tried to make this video short and easy to follow so anyone can do it. I hope this helps you to boost your FPS environment and I'll see you in the next video, see ya!